right, everyone, circle up. So, Kevin tells me we're halfway through development on Surfing with Sharks. Good work. Getting to the halfway point is half the battle. But I've been informed that Surfing with Sharks is not a battle royale game. We've talked about this. Uh, we never talked about battle royales. Well, we're talking about it now. I get this magazine, <laughs> the genre's gonna be big. Uh, battle royales are already big? Bigger. That's a fact. And if it's a fact, then you all should have seen it coming and pivoted months ago. You all know what a pivot is. Good term to know. But surfing with sharks is an endless runner. That's its thing. W well, endful runner. Who even knows what an endless runner is? No one, that's who. So as of today, I'm announcing big changes to surfing with sharks. It's no longer gonna be whatever it is. It'll be bigger, better, more profity. I want the gravy trains of gamer's wallets pouring down my gullet. Gross. Life is gross, Francine, but a little grossness is what this team needs. Okay, so what are these changes? Don't be cheeky, Stringbean. I'm announcing the existence of us making big changes, not the changes themselves. Starting today, we're pivoting. I'm all for improving the game, provided we can afford it and get extra time. Stop joking around. Look, it's my job to wrangle you crazy developers down to reality. It's your job to make reality work. So, like I always say, communication is the key to collaboration. Talk about this amongst yourselves. And remember, happy halfway through development day, team. Now, change everything. Am I missing something? Did he just tell us to turn our game into a battle royale? Jeb does this sometimes. Personally, I'm with Jeb. Everything is better with last man standing death and blood. You already made us add blood to surfing with sharks. You can never have enough blood. When the player touches the shark, they explode. Everything should explode, okay? We shouldn't change anything. We're halfway done. That'd be like starting over. Jeb didn't say we needed to specifically make it a battle royale, only that it needed to be a big pivot. Like following a big trend. Open world survival games are very trendy now. Oh god, I bet you want crafting too. We're not doing that. We could always add more story. An award-winning narrative could drive sales. Please, if we were serious about making money, we'd be making this a MOBA. Three letters. M-M-O. Class-based shooter. Boom. Done. I am not working on another class-based shooter. Why are we even having this conversation? Cute animals. Come we need cute animals. animals. Shooters. Shooters. Please. Please. Come on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on, everyone. I think I know how to solve this. Look, let's reconvene in 10 minutes. Midge, I need your help. Okay, can you go around and ask everyone what they would propose to Jeb here? We need to establish teams. Teams for... what? Just humor me. I wonder if the engineers are really hungry now that we stopped sending interns down there. Look, I'd love to stay here and chat with you, but I have a business to pretend to run. Don't touch that! That's my secret cabinet! Why am I messing with these? The file cabinets have nothing to do with asking my teammates what they would pivot to. Personally, I don't see what's wrong with crafting. Everyone likes a little crafting. Crafting adds depth. Crafting only slows down the death. Battle Royale is perfect for our endless surfing run or whatever. Okay, I think I know what you two would vote for. Yeah, everyone knows that gory stuff is what people want, okay? Common knowledge. I mean, maybe a battle royale isn't such a bad idea. <laughs> they can't cost that much to make, right? Probably millions of dollars. If that were true, the genre wouldn't have started out as mods for other games. I suppose I can't argue with that.
Thinking about it now, I think all we need is a trendy art direction change, you know? We haven't had an art director since Jess left. Oh, yeah. It's rough missing an art director. How long ago was this? Seven years. Oh, this map should be helpful. Can you imagine surfing with sharks with lanes and creeps and abilities? I'm all for adding MOBA elements to surfing with sharks. I don't think Francine wants me poking around in the storage closet. If I had to pick something, I think open world survival changes just fit. And that's where we keep all the company foam dart guns. Timothy, can you tell me what we can do to make Jeb happy? I'm sorry, I can't do that. Figures. Hello listeners, I'm JT, and with me as always is Rebel Breeze. We're your one-stop stop for culture news. Not all day, every day, but some of the days, some days, and that'll just have to do. What's up, Breeze? Uh, not much. So it seems we're at an impasse. No one can agree on the best way to pivot the development of surfing with sharks. There's only one way to settle this. Right, cupcake challenge. Mm, not this time, Pylon. Right here, right now, I challenge you all to a battle royale. I hate to break it to you. For a battle royale, you need over 60 people. We're not that. We're working with what we got, okay? Listen up, everyone. Calling all champions. 
Shovelworks Studios is only one office suite of this old mill complex. The rest is a maze of buildings, bridges, and basement tunnels. It's perfect for a battle royale. In my copious spare time, I had foam dart guns and other gear all over the mill. Find what you can. I've paired you all up into teams based on what you want to change with surfing with sharks. Each team will start at a random door and work their way back to the office. The first team to reach Jeb, or the last surviving team, wins. May the winds of fortune be infinitely blowing in your direction. That's not how battle royales work at all. Save it for the arena, naysayer. I'm not scared of you. Team Open World Survival for life. But we're still only eight people. That isn't even a skirmish royale. Uh, wait. How many people is a skirmish? Like at least 30. And they have to be at boats. Let's call it a studio brawl. That implies bar stools and broken bottles. I say we call it a tussle rumpus. A tussle? What? Look, it doesn't matter. Shovelworks Battle Royale begins now! Look, all I'm saying is that genres have rules. Battle Royales have tons of people, and also a ring of death closing it on the battlefield. Aw, oh, come on. Are we really going to spend the entire time nitpicking this? He named it a Battle Royale. It should be like a Battle Royale. Developers name things based on how they think they'll sell. What are you doing? Dancy boat. Huh. Okay, that's good. Um, can you not do that? No way. I worked hard to get these moves. You've always got to dance before the drop. It's how you get in the mood for a match. That's another thing. Battle Royales always start the match with a skydive. The drop is part of the experience. Well, this is my door. This complex is bigger than it looks. Yeah, used to be an actual shovel foundry. Now it's all divided into offices, dentists, tech companies, even a coffee shop. Anyway, your door's that way. Good luck. Right, thanks. Let's go team do nothing, right, Timothy? No, I can't do that. I'm surprised you picked my team. You don't seem like a Battle Royale kind of gamer. Well, I would have picked Team MOBA, except Francine and I don't get along these days. You and I don't get along either. Yeah, but you have a better chance of winning than the others. You got that right. No one else stands a chance against me. Provided we find some good loot. Let's get hunting. Don't you know where everything is if you planted these? Yes, but this is all pretend, so I can pretend I don't know anything. Oh, look, a sniper rifle. At least he got the loot part, right? There's a repeater. Hmm. I wonder what else there is. Let's find out. This thing is awesome. Whatever it is. This is a colander. It looks like the one we have back at the office. It'll make a good helmet. There's a drawing of a grenade here. Or a pineapple. Maybe both. I'll take it. I found another gun. Cool. Let me have that one. No way, I need two. You always need two guns. Seriously? Ugh, fine. I'll go find my own. Hello again. 
again, everyone. I'm JT. This is Rebel Breeze. We're... Level 2 hop-up here. I'll take that. Good. I don't even know what it is. That's just a plant. But it's a level 3 plant. Whatever this is, I must have it. Ooh, more loot. Whatever this is, I must have it. I've been looking my whole life for this. Someone out there probably appreciates the craftsmanship that went into this. They're an idiot. I've been looking my whole life for this. Somewhere, a Baba Toaster is crying about this. Tables are very good for defense, but you sacrifice a lot of mobility. Let's check this place out. Gearing up. Oh, I need this. A cardboard box? That's a bit too metal for me. This is a door to a therapist's office. You can't equip it. Looks like we've scoured this area clean. Moving out. Now that we're getting a little deeper, we have to be prepared for an attack at any moment. I know how combat works, okay? I've been playing video games since before I was born. Sure, sure. It's, it's just, you know, be prepared for anything. <laughs> Good one. Good thing that was friendly fire. <laughs> can't be friendly fire if I'm not your friend. I'm on your team. You can't shoot me. Also, I just kicked you off my team. You can't do that. We both have to agree to dissolve the team. Stop making up new rules. Let's just go. We've got to keep moving if we're going to reach Jeb before the others. And I'm already lost. This place is a maze. Timothy, can you tell me how to get to the office? No, I can't do that. Figures. Can you even fire that gun? I'm sorry, I can't do that either. Why do I get stuck with a stupid robot? Timothy, no! Using the corpse of her fallen comrade as cover? That's dark, Midge. Heads up, she's on the move. Hey, Timothy, you gotta wait till Midge takes your token to a respawn spot. You're out, stop moving around. No, I can't do that. Damn it, Timothy! Looks like they haven't renovated this area in a while. So, have you thought about how you'd propose changes to Jeb? Whoa, whoa, whoa. The winner has to propose their idea to Jeb? No one said anything about that. It's not like we can just change the game without getting him on board. We do that all the time. True, but this time Jeb asked about it, so we've got to talk to him about what we want to do. I actually don't want to do that. No. I don't like to talk to Jeb any more than I have to. And I don't care that much about this. I thought you wanted more blood in surfing with sharks. No amount of violence makes talking to Jeb enjoyable. Might as well shoot me now. What? That's right. Shoot me. Stop joking around. Oh, what? Never shot anyone in a foam dart battle royale before? Ugh, this your first time? Uh, first, I think Pylon said it was a scuffle royale. And, sure. Like, uh, all the time. Lies! Shoot me, you coward! No! Shoot me! I can't. We're on the same team. I'm pivoting. I quit the team. Shoot me! No! Shoot me, damn you! <laughs> Get away from me! Coward! I'll find you! <sighs> and make you shoot me. She's pinned down pretty good. She's impossible to hit! There's no way to get her out from behind that robot. Maybe I can lure her out with my dance moves. Please don't. I got this. You can't wall run in a battle royale? Oh, crap! <laughs> you can't in mine, sucker. It's my perk. How come I didn't get a perk? I don't know. Guess your character just sucks, dude. Sucks to be you. Shoot me! Stop wasting bullets, Kevin. 
<laughs> Joan, where are you? Where did you get a laser sight? My car. What? Ah! Run, little bird. Run. Run right to where I want you. I see you. Get away from me! Get away from me! Run, little bird. I see you. Running away! Run, oh, little no. bird. Yeah. Run, little bird. Yeah. Running away. Yeah. Oh, I got him again. Oh, my God. Midge, wait! Don't shoot! Why? I'm being followed! Yeah, so am I! Okay, look, I've got a plan. Couldn't I at least have some bullets? And arm my bait? No way! Hey, hey, it's our office's back door! We're nearly there, Midge! Someone's coming. Just act natural. Hello? Oh, Timothy, thank God. I thought it was someone else. Yipe! We found a vehicle! <laughs> a pylon! Ben! <laughs> Hi, guys. Time for you to meet the great designer in the sky, Kevin. Wait! Time out! I'm, I'm doing the hands! No, time out, said Scuffle Royale. Whoa, whoa! Pylon! Look out! <laughs> pylon! Damn you all the hell! <laughs> Cripes! Come on, come on, come on, come on. Where the hell are you? Ow! Two down. Your turn, Kevin. Joan, wait. I think we can come to some agreement here. Sure, an agreement where you're pretend dead. Hey. Huh? Y'all still need me? What are you doing, man? You're out. I know, I know, I know, but I got a dentist appointment in like 15, so I got a jet. Oh, cool. Yeah, totally. Good luck, dude. Oh, don't forget to floss. Now, back to you, Kevin. Beep! Hey, think fast, Joan. No, it can't be. No! Let's make this painless, Kevin. If I win, we don't do anything to the game at all. Pivoting doesn't mean starting from scratch. I kind of think it does. It doesn't matter. You have no weapon, no ammo, no chance. Hey, loot! Stop breaking me off! On guard, Midge. Who says that? What the hell? You might as well give up, Midge. Never. Ow. Mm, if only I still had my trusty sniper rifle. I'm ten feet away. Finally, I'm somebody. On guard, Midge. Who says that? Ow! Take this! Good thing I picked up all these shields while looting. Those are just cardboard. Ouch! Hey! 
Leave me alone. Finally, I'm somebody. On guard, Midge. Who says that? Yipe! Time to settle this. You think you can beat me? I'll show you. This fight begins now. Back? My shields are down. I've got one hit left. <laughs> I knew I would win. What's all that noise? What are you two doing? Uh, communicating. Looks like you're having a battle. Technically, it's a scuffle. Don't mind me, I'm just spectating. <clears throat> uh, this is an important part of making a game. Soon, we'll have a winner to present to you. There's a winner? Huh. I'm gonna go into my office now. Yeah, carry on. So, it's come to this. Sorry to bring you out of retirement, old gals, but we have work to do. What the hell is that? Run! Pylon, what are you doing here? I'm hiding from our boss! But you already died. Tell him that! Ow! What the hell? Acorns? He's firing acorns? Who does that? <laughs> I was born for this moment! We're pinned. There's no way out. Well, it's down to just you two anyway. Oh, really? Wait, where's Francine? Don't give up. All we need is a distraction. Uh, Pylon, go distract him. No way, did you see those acorns? Those are Northern Red Oak. You only live once. Go! You too, Midge. Buy me some time to think of a plan. All right, time to do this. Here, Midge, use this. Take this. Ah! I want. What? We surrender? Why did you make Pylon go out there? I needed time to think of a plan. And that plan was to surrender? Uh, yeah, it just took a while to think of it. There's no surrendering on my watch! You're only winning because you have a big gun! I'm winning because I'm crushing you! Ah! Shoot me! Holy crap! I don't want to talk to you, so shoot me! What's wrong with him? You said communication is the key to collaboration. This is what communicating looks like, okay? Shoot me! I'm pivoting, damn it! Well, I'm glad to see you're so eager, young man. Communicate this. Ow! Joan, you were eliminated! Oh, no, no. My other arm was eliminated. It's tough to use my offhand, but victory was worth it. I win. That's not how battle royales work. Cowards! All of you! Cowards! Wait, uh, Joan's the winner? The winner was the first to reach you. And shoot me? That part I did for fun. All of you are whiny baby developers. You make games for babies. But now that I'm champion, I can propose my pivot idea. Oh, let's hear it. 
Otters. Uh, otters. Otters. Otters? Otters. River otters? Oh, yeah. River otters? Sure. Why otters? Oh, otters are next year's kitten. Let's get ahead on the cuteness trend. I like the cut of your jib, Joan. We'll at least give it a battle royale name. I don't think we can get away with that. Uh, yeah, legally we can. Will there be a lot of otters? There can be as many as we want. It'll be cute overload. Oh, people will love it. <laughs>